Hi, my name is Phil, and I'm here today to talk to you about CISPR 7, which is the new version coming out in 2013. Now, these sneak previews we've got here are all about, well, we call it power tailoring. You might call it customization, but we like to believe that users can change the product the way they want it to make it look like. So, have a look at these. Customizing the main menu. A highlight of CISPR 7 is the ability to customize the main menu to suit the user's preferences, allowing them to easily access programs which they use more frequently. In this demonstration, you will see how we customize the main menu using docking panes and docking stickers. As a new CISPR operator, when you first log into CISPR, you will see the Favorites pane, which displays a tutorial which explains how to create a menu. It is these menus that you will use to navigate through the product to perform your daily or monthly tasks. Let's take a look at a customized menu. For this operator, he has added all the programs or applications that he uses most frequently in his favorites task panel. He also has a navigation pane where there are additional applications that he may require to use throughout the day. Also, there is an available flow graph which he uses to navigate. You can see from the positioning of the navigation pane and the flow graph that it is not that easy to see. So, as an operator, you can use your docking panes and your docking stickers to move your panes so that you can view your items and launch them more easily. To use the docking panes, click on the title bar and drag the docking pane. You will notice that this provides you with docking stickers. Because it's a flow graph, it's going to be quite long horizontally, so I'm going to dock it at the bottom of my window. I simply drop it on the docking sticker. I can also select my control button and scroll down to fit the flow diagram to my pane. Now my navigation pane still does not fit clearly. Therefore I'm going to create a tabbed page. Once again click on the title bar, drag that pane and to create a tabbed page I'm going to drag it directly on top of the existing pane. Here you can see how it has created a tab pane of my favorites and of my navigation pane. In my navigation pane I have more than one category that exists, so if I require to view another category I can select to minimize that category and it will display the next category called Excel. From here I can also select to add another pane to view. Perhaps I'd like to add my notepad pane, so I can select notepad and if I want it displayed down the right hand side I'm going to undock that by dragging it out and then placing it on the right hand docking sticker. And this completes the demonstration of customizing your main menu.